Well, that was interesting. This is a little electric heater that we use in our bathroom just as a kicker when we're taking a shower or something in the morning. And could smell something funny, smelled like a little electrical thing. So I turned off the heater and could still kind of smell it. And then my wife came in and she moved the heater and she could see a little scorch mark. From the... So yeah, that's something. <laughs> <laughs> so we almost burned our house down. Luckily, the bathroom floor isn't made of real wood. It's like one of those uh, ceramic fiberboard materials. And uh, that saved us from burning the house down. So this is yet one more example of why you don't want to leave like an electric heater unattended by itself. Because we were there and I couldn't see it. Because uh, there's no evidence of this little burn from the front. And there wasn't any smoke. <laughs> like... I thought it was the uh, the ceiling fan in the shower, maybe, that was doing it. So I had my wife turn off the ceiling fan in the shower, and she could still smell the smoke. And then she moved the heater, and she could see the scorch mark on the floor. There wasn't any sparking. There wasn't any noise. In fact, the heater, somehow, was still working up until the point where she carried it in this room here and set it down on the counter. All right, electric heaters. Hmm.